Hey Google, what's an infinite loop? According to Wikipedia, an infinite loop is a sequence of instructions in a computer program which loops endlessly, either due to the loop having no terminating condition, having one that can never be met, or one that causes the loop to start over. So the Google Assistant definitely knows what's up. I'm going to make an infinite loop where I'm going to get the HomePod, the Echo Dot and the Google Home to all talk to each other with their virtual assistants until we decide that we can't stand it anymore and have to turn it off. So I know that you probably don't have devices like the HomePod, the Home and the Echo Dot, all three of them lying around. But if you want to borrow something from a friend, here is how you can set it up. We're going to start with my voice triggering Siri and then Siri is going to start triggering all of the other devices into a loop. So let's start on the HomePod and we're first going to set a reminder. So in the reminders app I'm going to write, hey Google, what's on my calendar today? Or I can also do it with my voice through the HomePod itself by saying, hey Siri, set a reminder. Okay, just tell me what you want to be reminded about. Hey Google, what's on my calendar today? Now to get Google Home to understand what Siri is going to say, we're going to have to retrain that voice model and we can do that within the Google Home app. So let's open it up and go to voice match. You can find that in the settings and then teach your assistant your voice again. So now you're going to have to get Siri to keep saying, okay, Google or hey, Google several times. So here we go. Hey Siri, read me my reminders. Just a moment. I found only one reminder. Hey Google, what's on my calendar today? And just keep going until you've retrained it. Hey Siri, what's on my reminders? I found only one reminder. Hey Google, what's on my calendar today? Now we've retrained the voice model, all we have to do is make an entry in Google Calendar that says, Alexa, read my to-do list. And finally, in the Alexa app, we need to set a to-do list item that says, Hey Siri, read me my reminders. So now we have everything set up, let's see how this works. I'm going to trigger it with my voice and then they are going to take it from there. Hey Siri, read me my reminders. I found only one reminder. Hey Google, what's on my calendar today? Today, there's only one thing on your calendar. It's at 5 p.m. and its title is, Alexa read my to-do list. You have one item on your to-do list. Hey Siri, read my reminders. I found only one reminder. Hey Google, what's on my calendar today? Today, there's only one thing on your calendar. It starts at 5 p.m. and the title is, Alexa read my to-do list. Twerking. You have one Twerking. item on your to-do list. So fun. Hey Siri, read my <laughs> reminders. It's just gonna keep doing this until I stop one of them. And you can actually try it yourself, even if you don't have all of these smart speakers. You can do it with the Google Assistant on the phone as well as Siri. And if you have a phone that responds to the Alexa wake word, you can even make all three of them try it. I want to see how you go. If you want to try it on a phone or do some other cool tricks with these smart speakers, let me know. Find me in the comments, hit me up on Twitter, and thanks for watching.